the last century and a half we've been relying on oil and gas fossil fuels to, to kind of power our world but but we know that it's not good for the planet you know so we know that the, the carbon emissions is going up there it's, it's it's driving global warming and and there's a whole set of environmental issues that's that's spilling off the back of that so the direction of travel for the energy world is, is pretty clear it's going to be renewables it's going to be wind it's going to be solar and it's going to be geothermal Deep geothermal works by drilling two deep wells. The production well is the deepest at 4.5 kilometres and it will suck hot water out of an underground reservoir which will be passed through a heat exchanger and will drive a turbine. The water will then be injected into an injection well at a shallower depth of 2.5 kilometres and this water will circulate between the wells creating a renewable system that is on a continuous loop. We have done a vision for energy which has very ambitious targets that by 2030 that Cornwall will be producing 100% of its electricity from within the county. The only hope we've got of achieving it is if we do bring forward projects such as this which will enable us to boost up the renewable energy supplies in the county. So we're really banking on this to be a success. Cornwall's ready to take on any type of technology such as this, so all the component parts are there to grow it. If it's proven and it works, I think Cornwall actually will take it and grasp it and run with it and become real success. To be able to have a solution like that in Cornwall would be so exciting. To know that there's this great opportunity, not only for the community that live around that area, but just to know that Cornwall can do something wonderful again. I'm very excited that we could possibly be spearheading a way of generating clean renewable energy that has absolutely no pollution whatsoever and will also generate new industries that we haven't even dreamed of. I'm very optimistic uh, about what I'm hearing in the community uh, about how they're receiving the ideas that are coming out of geothermal already. As a Polguth boy, you know, who grew up with mines on either side, we're half tin, half clay in Polguth, you know, to find ourselves going back underground now to find the kind of key resource for the 21st century in a way that is only beneficial for the environment uh, is a great, exciting thing to do.